there, it's Anonymous Tea, where we spill the tea anonymously. Hello, 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 everyone. Hello, YouTubers. Hope you guys are all having an amazing day today, sending good vibes, sending positivity, sending blessings, and good energy to each and every single one of you. Thank you so much for tuning in. So today we're talking Love and Marriage DC, and, and it is in limbo. We are talking the ratings, as you guys know, whether the ratings increase or decrease. We are going to talk about it. As you know, we had the season finale last week as well as the reunion episode back to back because uh carlos king and owen and discovery are trying to package up the show and throw it away i uh, so the previous episode the episode prior to the season finale uh had a grand total of 180 uh 9,000 viewers uh nonetheless uh even less people tuned into the finale you guys 186,000 people uh remembered that the season finale was coming on or just decided you know what skip it i will just watch the reunion and see what happens to the reunion and go from there and that is what people did people tuned in oh a mere 19,000 more people you guys a mere 19 more thousand people tuned in uh, to the reunion at a grand total of 205,000 viewers. And the season average was 193,000 viewers, which is a worse uh, for this season. Uh, nonetheless, I uh, we got to talk about it. Uh, there's no updates on whether or not the show is going to be renewed. There are no updates. Uh, according to Winter, nobody in the cast apparently allegedly hasn't received any new return letters uh, to come back. Remember that this season took nearly a year to come back. We are watching over a year old footage. Uh, remember Carlos King ignored this cast for 10 months uh, as they were demanding to know when the show was coming back meanwhile uh you know love and marriage huntsville and love and marriage dc uh, detroit was being pushed um instead of airing a new season of dc uh we have heard of course winner say multiple occasions that she's done with the show she's removed herself from carlos king's live with the reality tv king tour date i uh, also i uh, ashley and dj quick may not be coming back they keep saying they're done with the show uh so so what is casting going to look like what it where what is the future you guys and is this going to be the first of several you know cards to come tumbling down I, I just don't understand, you know, where we can go from here if these people, number one, are making pennies, if number two, uh, people are picking and choosing uh, who they want to hold accountable, and then allowing a toxic work environment to where people can just talk any old kind of way to each other, and there's no consequences. Anything for clicks and views, anything for ratings, but even that isn't enough to get the people to tune in should they bring back monique should monique come back but but now uh monique would have to be like listen we're we're not about to be doing that three thousand an episode thing again right but where do we go from here where do we go from here do you think any of these shows right now are getting renewed or do you think this is intentional so that all of carlos king's shows can be canceled and he can be a full-time blogger on YouTube, you guys. Let's talk about it. Uh, let me know what you guys think about this in the comments. Please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Hit the notification bell so you're notified the moment I post new content on my channel. And with that being said, I'll talk to you guys again very soon.